The story starts with Spider-Man and Wolverine tied to a pole, surrounded by a crowd holding axes with fire all around them. Breaking the tense silence, Spider-Man tries to speak. Um, but Wolverine cuts him off. Let me guess, big guy with a bat hit you? Next thing you know, you're here? Spider-Man, turning his head toward Wolverine, responds, Yeah, and there was this little guy with nunchucks, too. Totally didn't kick my butt, by the way. Spidey looks around and adds, So, uh, here we are again, huh? The two glance at each other for a moment. Wolverine, after a pause, says, Sorry about your uncle. Surprised, Spider-Man asks, What? How did you... He stops, trying to remember something, then says, Wait a minute, did we wrestle? Oh God, I remember that now. Spider-Man, awkwardly trying to console Wolverine, says, Sorry about your entire family. He then adds, I met your brother. Wolverine, now clearly annoyed, snaps, I don't want to hear about it. Spidey tries to explain, I was all covered in meat for some reason. You don't remember a guy in a mask all covered in meat? How could you not remember that? Wolverine, with a serious expression, says, We're being toyed with. Looking at the people surrounding them, Spider-Man agrees. Yeah, sort of seems that way, huh? Wolverine continues, This is all for somebody's amusement. Meanwhile, someone is watching this scene from a TV screen, barking orders at their team. Camera two, give me a close-up. This looks like crap. Back at the pole, Wolverine angrily says to Spidey, I bet you they're watching us right now. Somebody's been yanking our chain this whole time, making us look like damn fools. And here we are, right back at square one. Spider-Man half-jokingly adds, Well, I agree with the part about you looking like a fool, but I don't know about that last bit. As he says this, Spidey opens his hand to reveal he's holding a diamond. The mysterious figure watching them on the screen, clearly irritated, yells, but here we hold ourselves to a higher standard, camera two. The figure is revealed to be Mojo as he exclaims, over the years, I have worked myself to the bone to make my name synonymous with only the finest in quality entertainment. Mojo, with a creepy grin, adds, when people hear Mojo, they think fun. Good, clean, extravagantly violent fun. With a twisted smile, he finishes, so what say we give the good people what they want? <laughs>